Hello, and welcome to Score Cloud Studio. We'd like to show you how to get started. First, connect a MIDI keyboard and start playing. Or use the on screen piano to play on your computer keyboard. The program understands you best if you play in a moderate tempo with organic musical timing. When you finish playing, just double click to analyze. And there it is. In ScoreCloud, you don't have to play with the click track. Although, some songs, for example those with extensive syncopation, benefit from using a click track. If you select an area, you can re-record with the record button. Or use the overdub tool to record another voice. Editing in ScoreCloud is done with the tools in the toolbar and by double-clicking and right-clicking objects in the score. Some objects can be edited in the Actions window. Notice that ScoreCloud's Contextual Help window shows what you can do with the selected objects. Here is an example that we would like to fix. Begin with global editing, using the buttons in the toolbar. These are the changes that affect the whole score. Editing time signatures is done with the time and rhythm tool. We want the time signature in this song to be four-fourths. We would also like to make all the note values half as big, which also can be done in this tool. Now the time signature is right, but we need to move the entire score one beat to the left, so that it starts in the first beat. We do that using the Pickup tool. Press the playback button to hear what it sounds like. The key signature here is F major, but we want C major, so we change it with the Transpose tool. Continue with local editing specific details directly in the score. You can change timing errors by dragging the bar line. ScoreCloud will recalculate all following bars. To move a note, just drag it up and down and left to right. Hold Alt and drag to change duration. Or to change accidentals. To remove notes or other objects, Select and press Backspace. If you remove a rest, the note before the rest will fill its space. To delete a measure, just select the whole measure and then press Control Backspace. A really great feature is the beat by beat editing. Select a beat and play the notes and rhythms in any tempo. If you want to change this to triplets, select the beat and press Alt-3 
to divide the bead into three. If you want sixteenths, change the subdivision to four with Alt-4. To copy and paste, select a region and choose Copy. Then paste it anywhere by selecting a beat and choosing Paste. You can give your song a name and finish your score by naming the parts and adding repeats, lyrics, chords, dynamics, articulations, and slurs. A lot of this can be found in the Add More tool. Now, just save your song, print it, and share it, or export to MIDI or Music XML for further editing. Thank you for watching. You can check out more videos, the program manual, and much more on our website. Don't hesitate to contact us with any questions. Bye.